Welcome to Tamil Movies Review in English. In this video we review about Singam, released on 2010. This movie starts with villain Mailwaganam, who lives in Tiruvanmiyur, Chennai. He acts like cardiac attack and drawn to hospital. Vaikundam, who is Mailwaganam's brother. Manokaran, who is Mailwaganam's assistant. His henchmen confront Sundar, who is Mailwaganam's opponent, who rising up to Mail's power. Sundar planned and came hospital to kill Mailwaganam. Where Mailwakanam slashes Sundar's throat with a sword and his men retreat. Mailwahanam, a decent rowdy who rules the entire Chennai city with his power. He will kill those who are against him. There are many people who yearn for money. One of them will surrender on his behalf to the police. The law too will punish the innocent who came to surrender for him. The land in Chennai where computer companies are built will be taken by him on lease. And file a case and get stay order. He will threaten and get money, and it is Mail Vahanam lifestyle it in Chennai, in Nallur, to Thikudi district. Some people came to temple. They said that we are from Virudunagar district. Three generations before this deity was our family deity. We have come here to prepare offerings and worship the deity. They await for the movement. They attacked temple managers, stole temple jewels. Manager informed police station. Sub Inspector Durai Singam thwarts a temple robbery and caught them. Sub Inspector Durai Singam, a brave and just police officer who serves in his hometown primarily to satisfy his dad's desire, Durai Singam resolves every dispute in his town patiently with his words of wisdom and resorts to force only when the situation demands it. Afterwards, wealthy businessman Mahalingam and his daughters Kavya and Divya arrive in Nallur to visit their grandparents. Palani, who is house servant, came for receive Mahalingam family. Durai Singam's best friend and colleague Ilumalai visits Singam's family. Here, Singam's father Soundrapandi, his mother Kalyani, his grandmother, and his sister Dhanalakshmi, and her kids. Durai Singam shut up a culprit in the house. He used to lock in here the important prisoners. He has to tell the testimony against ten people, so he has to be kept safe in his house. Later that night, many villagers flee upon seeing a tiger. Durai Singam thought it was a thief. He caught and slapped, removed mask. It is Kavya. What is this disguise for? She asked. I was going to threaten my uncle's daughter. All thought that I am the tiger. She said, If someone has stabbed you with a stick, what if I shoot you with a gun? Irritating idiot. Like he scolded her. He warns her not to pull such a prank again. And Kavya feels insulted. Kavya planned to slap on his cheek to take revenge. So the next day, Kavya, Divya. One of her friends and her houseworker Palani go to the temple to prank Dhuri Singam. They plan to slap him when he close his eye for worship. But they slapped Elumalai. Next she thrown coconut. Dhuri Singam apologizes for the misunderstanding and slapping her. Kavya begins to have feelings for him. In Chennai, Mailwaganam's brother telephoned Rangarajan, who is a businessman, said his son is to be kidnapped. Your boy is playing basketball now. Two hours time is there. arrange for 45 lakh rupees right away then mailwaganam says in the register office yesterday in the stamp paper you put 60 lakhs as value i know you have taken 1 crore rupees you have to bring 45 lakh rupees to release your son otherwise you will lose your son threatened him then they get money from rangarajan in the next morning kavya told her grandmother her chain lost it is platinum solitaire diamond was in it it costs 4 lakhs Her grandfather told to complaint in police station. Kavya used this and planned to go to meet Durai Singam. So Kavya and her sister come to Durai Singam's house. Said her chain lost. He asked her how did she lose? When did she see last? Before the supper last night, she said. What dress she wore when sleeping at night? He asks. She said night dress. After he investigated her and said the chain in your night dress. She back to house and found the chain. Later, Kavya Kam Police Station gave complaint that her mobile phone was lost. He investigated and said the phone may be in silent mode somewhere in her house itself. Kavya, her sister, grandfather, and house servant go for matinee when a local rowdy teased Kavya. Her grandfather angrily hold his shoulder and told if the native people knows it they will hack him. Rowdy took her cloth, said, "Let the native guy come and get it back." Grandfather went to Durai Singam house told this to him. Durai Singam fetch Kavya to theater asked manager to close entrance gate and to stop people here Who is it who have abused a girl I came to inquire about the case 
in which a girl has been molested who is that dog who abused her if he have any guts let him do that now dhurai singham shouted rowdies tried to attack dhurai singham but he assaulted that rowdies get back her cloth do not forget to subscribe our channel thumbs up our videos click notification to get videos instantly then later dhurai singham called kavya's phone number which she lost her house servant palane attended the phone dhurai singham identified that was palani and traced his place caught him he said kavya madam gave these all the dhurai singham come kavya's place he warns her here kavya exposed her love to him and told her feelings about him dhurai singham speaks nothing and went in chennai malwa ganam and his brother threatened old man to give 50 lakhs otherwise they will complain to income tax department about his properties also register police case against him for fake rape case he demanded give amount on next day later the old man sent a mail to his son about malwa ganam and he killed himself because of the suicide malwa ganam comes in as a suspect and has to head to nallur to sign a condition bail vagundam relegates their friend haba sanmugan who is stationed in tuthikudi to sign in his place Sanmugan's men attempt to sign the bail but Dhuri Singham identified that they are not from Chennai and confronts Sanmugan Dhuri Singham demands that Malwa Ganam to be here in another 3 hours in Nallur as soon as possible and if not we will get a arrest warrant that he has not come Malwa Ganam arrives in Tuthikudi and angrily confronts Dhuri Singham for dragging him all the way from his home and even threatens to arrest him Do you know who I am Do you know my range Malwa Ganam asks with Dhuri Singham You are a killer. I have read your case sheet. You have trapped a man, threatened him and made him commit suicide. Dhurai Singham replies. Malwagan threatens kill Singham and demolish police station. The villagers attack Malwaganam's vehicles and riot in response. Dhurai Singham has Malwaganam seal the bail he warrants for the remaining 14 days. Don't make a propaganda of his visits. And sends him off, leaving him humiliated. Mile swears to get him back. Before go to Chennai Mahalingam family went to temple while speaking with Dhurai Singham's father Magalingam said waste will only go for a cops job they had quarrel meanwhile Dhurai Singham accepts Kavya's love both Singham and Kavya not aware of their father's quarrel later sub inspector Dhurai Singham promoted as inspector of police and transfer to Chennai when he come Chennai first he went to see Kavya and told about his promotion she felt very happy about this sound while they speak Mahalingam seen them and went to her room told her that do not spoil our family's prestige and first erase that policeman number he warns her when he joins his duty Ravi who is sub inspector of police in the station Ravi hates Malwaganam for his crimes but is unable to take any action because of Malwaganam's political powers he welcomes Singam then Malwaganam came with his henchman and told that by his intention he get promotion and posting in Tiruvanmayur to make singam to run without the uniform hence fourth miles men will trouble and torture singam he would spend sleepless nights thinking every day about his job malwa ganam threatened singam and went dhurai singam shocked about his sound later malwa ganam goons came station asked singam to file case on them he asked them to go out but they hits policeman singam brutally beats the goons up assistant commissioner rajendran telephoned and asked to release them Police got information about murder in nearby slum. Dhurai Singham team rushed to the slum, but Malwaganam's goons said that chicken shopkeeper killed two goats, four hens, and killing is his profession. File him a case and put into the jail. Dhurai Singham feels insult. While he returned, he phoned Kavya, asked her to meet. Dhurai Singham tells her that not willing to service here, so decided to leave this job. Kavya tells him that Singham of all people shouldn't give up on establishing justice no matter how hard it seems and that his family and people wouldn't respect him and she encourages him to fight against Malwaganam and end up his crime network being mentally tortured by Malwaganam Dhuri Singham retaliates and starts arresting Malwaganam's men one by one even if they don't break any laws and frames them for crimes Malwa Ganam's brother Vaikundam came police station and asked Dhurai Singham to release his men. Singham arrests Vaikundam in a fake case of illegally smuggling alcohol. Rajendran assistant commissioner is on Malwa Ganam's payroll and takes care in concealing and eliminating the evidence of Malwa Ganam's crimes from the eyes of the law. The commissioner also does not help Dhuri Singham as there is no evidence against Malwa Ganam. 
and Rajendran wants Singham to stay away from Miles case and release them out. But Singham asked him to return form, otherwise get out of the station. This is one of the police stations which is in my control. Commissioner said, but this is the one and only police station which is in my control. If anybody comes and disturb my work I won't spare them. Dhurai Singham said and kicks him out of the station. Singham confronts Mile in his house and makes it clear that he won't surrender to him ever. Everyone would have seen three loin emblems in a police cap. There is a fourth loin emblem in the backside. No one would have seen that. If you like to see it, you won't be alive. Dhurai Singham understand that. It seems he is not doing real estate and solving disputes alone. He has network all over Tamil Nadu. Singham believes he is doing something else illegal other than extortion. Mahalingam's daughter Divya kidnapped for money. Mailvaganam threatening Divya's father and ask ransom. Singham finds Mahalingam acting suspiciously and finds out that Divya kidnapped for money. Singham and Ravi plan to rescue Divya and to catch kidnappers to find who is behind them. As it is, they rescued Divya and firing them and caught two of them. Finally finds Mailvaganam is behind this kidnap. Singham realizes that this is how he extorts the public. Ramanathan who is home minister meets Durai Singham appreciates him and promote Durai Singham as the new assistant commissioner and leader of the anti kidnapping force later Durai Singham's family came to his house in chennai unexpectedly kavya also came to singham's house here durai singham acts as kavya is unknown person and escaped from the spot then sondara pandi family came to magalingam's house with kavya sondara pandi speaks innocent and ask apologies for misunderstanding after they went, Magalingam nods for Kavya's marriage with Dhurai Singham. Later, a lady came to meet Singham in police station. She introduces herself as Sumathi. She gave complaint that some goons are teasing her. Fortunately, Singham noticed she is sending message to someone. He understand that she is giving false complaint. Singham instruct Ravi to collect her details. She asked Singham to visit her residential to warn that goons. Meanwhile, on the way, Singham knows her details. She redirected and on gunpoint investigation, she disclosed the secret that she was sent by Mailwaganam and his henchmen are awaiting to kill him. Quickly, Singham arranged police squad to attack goons. In this attack, Miles' brother escaped, Manokaran and others are killed. Even though Singham framed, Manokaran was severely wounded and under treatment in hospital. Singham said that Manokaran came to conscious and accepts to reveal the truth. Policeman informs to Rajendran that Manokaran become a prover. Rajendran informs to Vakuntam. Now, Vakuntam come to kill Manokaran in hospital. Singham and Ravi team waited for Vakuntam. Singham said Manokaran killed in attack. Here we dragged him to kill. Mailwaganam begged Singham to leave him alive, but Singham killed Vakuntam. For revenging Singham, Mailwaganam sent goons to kill Kavya. While she trying to escape, Mailwaganam shoot Kavya and who is admitted into the hospital. Fortunately she is all right but Mile murders Singham's friend Ravi who worked with him since he came to Chennai Mile threatens to kill everyone Singham loves in meeting with his higher officers Dhurai Singham gave proof that Rajendiran have connection with Mailwaganam and got permission to take him in custody for investigation now Singham receives support from Rajendiran who lies to the home minister that Mile kidnapped his daughter for ransom Home Minister Ramnathan gives all power to Singham team to catch Mailwaganam in 24 hours. Miles' house is searched through and has a warrant placed on him. Mile kidnaps Karnataka's Home Minister's daughter and demands Singham that, if he doesn't get out of India safely, that she will suffer. Mailwaganam directs all police to Pondicherry, but he go to Andhra Pradesh. Singham tracks him and find he is going by train. In all the way Dhurai Singham reached the train to rescue Karnataka's home minister's daughter. Mailwaganam get down in Nellore. Singham team follow them. Mile receives Nellore goon's support to escape. Step by step Dhurai Singham reached Mailwaganam. Do not forget to subscribe our channel, thumbs up our videos, click notification to get videos instantly. In a critical situation, Singham shoots the girl to force Mile into letting her go. Now, the girl is safe and taken away by two policemen. Singham fights Mailwaganam and wounds him. He tells Mile that he won't arrest nor kill him. But leave him be. Since all of Chennai is against him and he can't do anything about it. Mile arms himself and looks for Singham who sees him coming. Singham believed he could arrest him. If he regretted his actions, but since he doesn't, Singham shoots, finally Mailwaganam dead.
Singham is complimented for his dauntlessness and drive, yet Singham chooses to leave his work and follow his actual energy and run his family's store in Tuthikudi. Ramnathan visits Singham, uncovering that the resignation was fake and that Singham has been relegated to explore risky weapon smuggling in Tuthikudi. At the point when he figures out why it's occurring he is to make a move and shut down it. Thank you for watching this movie. Like and subscribe our channel. Hit bell for new videos. Singham is revealed to work as the NCC master at a higher secondary school in Tutukkudi, since he was recently taught in military. And student named Satya breaks into the school and releases the computer science question paper on mobile phone. Next day school teachers seen that question papers were uncovered. And principal calls Dhurai Singham to investigate. Singham finds a couple of lost contact focal points in the office room to Satya and confronts her. He at first takes steps to punish her but observes that she is academically good and cheated when her teacher treated the understudies unjustifiably. Singham warns her to not do such activities in future. Later, one day morning, in school prayer, a student's father came with his men and tried to hit a teacher for punishing his son in classroom. Dhurai Singham fought with them. Meanwhile Satya calls local police station and informs the situation. Do not forget to subscribe our channel. Subscribe and click bell button for more Tamil cinema stories. Feel free to hit your comments. And police officer Kareem, who from Tuthikudi's police district confronts Singham for getting involved in the fight. But he is let go off. Dhurai Singham returns to school and appreciates Satya's quick thinking for calling police and thanks her. Satya starts to have feelings for him and heavy infatuation on Dhurai Singham. Later, Singham and Kavya's family talks terms of marriage. But Soundrapandi is disappointed with Singham resigning the police. Mahalingalm assures to make Singham as boss in his company, but Soundrapandi dislikes and refuses marriage. One late evening, Singham notices a smuggler named Saghayam, who works under Bhai. Saghayam got information from supporting policeman about someone as noticing his work and reports his exercises to the police. Saghayam's men pursue Singham and endeavor to kill him, yet he fights them off. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe our channel. Click bell button for video updates. The following day, Saghayam is faced by his boss Bhai, who is dealer in Tutukkudi, an influential where who runs a criminal realm in Tutukkudi. Bhai shows his anger at Saghayam for let secret watcher alive. Saghayam guarantees Bhai that they'll figure out who impeded them. They suspect David, an occupant who has been taking their items unapproved. Saghayam catches David and murders him tossing his body over the edge his boat. Suse later shows Singham around the coasts and tells Singham concerning Saghayam and Bhai's work as seen by local people. However that Bhai has strict influence on police department. Satya's uncle Thangaraj is a businessman and proprietor of a delivery organization and holds Bhai and his powers under wraps when the police fail to address it. Saghayam talks with his men the whereabouts of Bhai and his anonymous partner's more significant position. The worldwide drug ruler Danny, who lives confined from society on his yacht in the sea. Danny murders an Australian line official and informs Bhai to take in a new shipment of drugs. Later at night, Singham figures out that Bhai and Saghayam are really pirating cocaine into India and offering it to local people. All he takes photo for evidence. Next day, Satya calls Singham said that she's been kidnapped. When Singham reached at the Manapad church where she called, she uncovers it to be completely false and admits affections for Singham. Singham irately scolds Satya and advises her to give him her necklace to close the kidnapping is robbery. Thangaraj becomes irritated and arranges his men to track down the alleged criminals. He calls Singham in personally to thank him. When Thangaraj met Dhurai Singham becomes suspicious and starts to check his status. Singham makes it clear to Satya that students can't be in relationship with a teacher and to let him go. Even she does not take it serious. Singham contacts Ramnathan to give a status report on the carrying case. Singham makes sense of that genuinely a modest quantity of drugs delivered into the country can guarantee a huge number of youthful school students' lives through drug gatherings and exchanges. And that main a modest quantity of captures for drug-related charges are made. Insufficient to clear out the business. Singham states that to completely close the drug exchange they should track down the main providers. He has likewise mentioned that Ramnathan transfer his companions Erimalai and Dhamodharam to help him. The following day, Satya leaves the school, trusting that she can get an opportunity with Singham.
One day, due to a verbal fight in a bar, Saghayam and his men kidnaps a girl named Selvi from another caste after her brother insults him and holds her with them for a day. This causes violation between both gangs in the city. Dhurai Singham calls Erimalai and learns of the problem. Singham contacts Ramnathan to request him to hire and takes charge as new DSP. Singham sends the entire force to various parts of the city and arrests the gang members. And Singham follows the hijackers by their phone signs to a lodging and tracks Saghayam to a confidential island where he keeps Selvi hostage. Arrests Saghayam and his gang from island and returns Selvi to her family. He is praised by the public and is also forgiven by his father. Thangaraj is informed regarding Singham rejoining the force. After rejoining, Singham becomes friends with official Karim and permits Suse to live in Nallur after he assists Singham with capturing Saghayam. Singham keeps on researching the drug case and busts any shops and vendors selling cocaine. Furthermore, Satya determinedly attempts once more with Singham when he rejoins the police even after Singham clears up for Satya that it's impractical. Kavya's houseworker Palani sees them together and gets suspicious and illuminates Kavya. Singham sees Thangaraj speeding and follows him. Where he goes out to the ocean. Singham ends in up in Bhai's area and it's uncovered that Thangaraj has been Bhai's anonymous accomplice from the start. Thangaraj lashes out and reprimands Saghayam, who has been paroled with Bhai's impact about beginning the mobs. Bhai guarantees Thangaraj that the police force under Singham's initiative has just been busting drug exchanges and that they won't ever be gotten. Singham quickly concludes that they should capture Saghayam once more and track down that he is a suspect in David's murder. He sends the policeman to get blood tests from David's family and Karim to track down David's carcass. As Singham and the police work to interface Saghayam to the reason for David's death. Thangaraj plans a party in which he chooses to welcome Danny after 12 years of confinement adrift. Thangaraj prepares and welcomes Singham's higher police officer to keep them dismissed from everything related this issue. Even Singham asks Erimalai and Karim for his job. Ezrumalai tracks Saghayam's whereabouts and tracks down that he's made a trip outside the coast. The evening of Thangaraj's party. The police force surrounds Saghayam when he accompanies Danny to his harbour. Singham at first becomes suspicious of Danny when he hangs with Saghayam men. He lets Danny go, however captures him when Danny affronts the police. Karim observes that Danny's identification is phony and that he has no visa or work license for the harbour. Bhai informs Thangaraj regarding Danny's capture and Thangaraj has numerous politicians and specialists whom he's companions with call Singham and inspire him to let Danny go. Singham sorts out that Thangaraj is bugging the station into letting Danny go and asks why it's so significant. Singham explores Danny and figures out his way of life as a drug provider. Singham is called by his higher police officer who are at Thangaraj's party as a set interruption. Meanwhile Bhai sends a few men to break Danny out and obliterate the station. The assault kills many police and harms Karim who is hospitalized. Do not forget to subscribe our channel. Subscribe and click bell button for more Tamil cinema stories. Feel free to hit your comments. Danny is accompanied out to the ocean again where he calls Thangaraj and reprimands him to kill Singham for insultingly capturing him. Singham sends the whole power out to track down Danny without any result due to Thangaraj's impact on the city. And he is chastened by his unreliable higher police officer and rebuffed with suspension. The following day he stands up to Bhai and vows to arrest Danny. Singham tells Ramnathan the following day that utilizing standard guidelines to manage Danny won't work. And that they will need to frame a planned activity to capture each drug provider in the city. And catch Danny. Singham rejoins and takes charge of the force getting his higher police officer suspended and systematically captures Bhai's men and anybody who has been purchasing drugs. Singham is subsequently visited by Satya to take her jewelry back and is seen by Kavya. Singham makes sense of Satya's uneven sentiments towards him and Kavya states that she will converse with her. In view of Singham's impedance, Bhai sends a Sri Lanka professional killer to kill Singham. The professional killer shoots Erimalai coincidentally and is pursued by Singham. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe our channel. Click bell button to get videos instantly. Singham and the professional killer battle in the focal city and Singham shoots the professional killer. Bhai sends a vehicle to kill the professional killer and he is called by Singham with a capture danger, sending him on the run. 
Satya is stood up to by Kavya that midday about hitting on Singhim and Satya fronts Kavya. Singhim faces Satya and she mournfully apologizes and later becomes companions with the couple. Singhim later follows Bhai who means to take in Danny's new shipment and convey it to Saghayam. Boo's hanging out after Danny's departure. Bhai goes to Chennai and Singhim has official Rajendran to track Bhai. Rajendran informs Singhim that Bhai gets flight to Trivandrum. Singhim's partner's companions who is on the police force track Bhai to a woodland refuge. Singhim and his men trap Bhai's group and have them generally captured. Bhai's whole armed force involved in violation. After the city however Singhim strengthens Tuthikudi's middle once more. And has them captured and beaten. Singhim likewise figures out how to get all the police who work for Bhai terminated. Singhim faces Thangaraj and informs him regarding his insight into his foul play. He calls up police scouts in the town of Rameshwaram to kill Saghayam and saves Thangaraj trusting he'll change. While on Dhurai Singhim and Kavya's engagement function, Mile Vaganam's former partner Habar Sanmugan came and informs Singhim that Thangaraj has recruited hooligans to kill Singhim. Singhim goes up against the hooligans that evening and fights them off, let Thangaraj know that he'll fight back. Thangaraj calls up Danny and advises him to avoid India along these lines. Danny calls Singhim by and by and illuminates him that he won't win, to which Singhim answers that he will find him any place he's stowing away and capture him. Singhim has a package of cocaine sent to Thangaraj's home to get him for drug carrying, to Satya's concern. During the seizure at Thangaraj's home, his men let him know that they checked Satya's vehicle GPS and that she had never been to the place where she professed to be stole, and the way that she currently has her accessory apparently upholds this. She has additionally considered her uncle's iPad secret word basically to play on it. Yet Thangaraj suspects her niece is working with the police and teaches his sibling, Satya's dad to kill her. Satya is tracked down harmed the following day yet Singhim won't really accept that it's a self-destruction since he told Satya regarding her uncle's criminal operations and that she was killed for it. Singhim defies Thangaraj in prison and pounds him in reprisal and pledges to get him a capital punishment for killing Satya. Utilizing Thangaraj's held on to telephone, Singhim follows Danny's cell action and tracks down that he's in touch with a companion in South Africa and that he's resting in Madagascar. Singhim gets support from Ramnathan notwithstanding the public authorities scratch off of their drug capture activity. He gives Singhim every one of the legitimate records to make a beeline for Durban South Africa only days before his marriage with Kavya. Singhim tells Kavya he can't rest till he finds Danny since Satya previously forfeited herself for his work. Singhim lands in South Africa the following day and joins Major Carl Ambrose of Durban's police force and the two work together to find Danny and his contact Alex, a Durban-based ware. After a vehicle pursue, Alex is killed and Danny departures to the harbour. Ambrose's men capture Alex's soldiers and Singhim stands up to Danny on his yacht, shooting a large portion of his group. Singhim battles Danny and overpowers him. He carries Danny to India under arrest and imprisons him into Thikudi. After arresting drug smuggler Danny, Dhurai Singhim and Kavya are got married. Meanwhile, a tough debate occurs in Andhra Pradesh State Assembly about the long-pending murder case of Vizek City Police Commissioner Ramakrishna. The Home Minister of Andhra Pradesh proposes recruiting Singhim from Tamil Nadu to Vizek as the new Deputy Commissioner of Police by order under the Central Bureau of Investigation. Then, Dhurai Singhim is hired to close the Police Commissioner Ramakrishna murder case by two months. When Dhurai Singham receives order, Kavya also planned to work in her company in Vizek. For Kavya's security purpose, Singham tells his unmarried Selvam and Gun Ravi. Both are working for Vizek's most powerful dawn and business owner MS Reddy. Selvam sends Ravi and his goon to attack Dhurai Singham in train station. Dhurai Singham fights with them, defeats Ravi and his men. Vidya, who follows Singham from train station to police station. She introduces herself as a student and gets Dhurai Singham's autograph. Singham meets Inspector Shubha Rao, Officer Srinivas and Constable Anwand. Singham starts to behave as a corrupt police and throws case file. But secretly investigates the murder of Commissioner. M.S. Reddy scolds Selvam and Ravi for assaulting a Dhurai Singham unnecessarily in train station. M.S. Reddy calls Vital Prasad, who as a businessman lives in Sydney. He ships garbages from medical and electronic factories in exchange for free steel supplies for his company, Whittle Steels. 
Vital calls his dad, who is Ram Prasad, aviation minister in India, to investigate Durai Singh him when he gets information of his arrival by Reddy. Constable Viram, who used to live in Durai Singham's neighboring town and honestly loves Singham, affirming that Bhai and Danny are at present in jail. While Thangaraj was sentenced for capital punishment, Viram inquiring about the health of Singham's family and about his marriage. Other polices are confused since he expressed he was unmarried. Singham lets Viram know that both are separated, which is subsequently uncovered as a cover to keep her safe. When Vidya makes frequent visits to Singham, Singham dislikes and avoids her. Viram and Vidya become friends in their common interests. Later, Singham and Viram went to mall where Reddy's men took customs officer's child. Singham noticed and follows them. They asked him to make his signature in customs file to clear Reddy's containers from port. They threatened him to abuse his wife and kill his child. Singham fights them and saved them. You are watching cinema stories. Please subscribe our channel and hit bell button for more video. Singham visits customs officer, says plan to capture more containers and gets signature. Singham, Shubha Rao and Viram are in hotel. Vidya came and gets Singham's reference signature for her police service examination. Kavya asks Singham to meet her in room number 406, where Shubha Rao seen them. Then, Singham revealed as a cover to keep her protected. Singham finds that a constable at the station has gotten sick from consuming an expired medicine tablet. Then Singham tasks to Srinivas to investigate about the medicine. He finds that the medicine tablet was supplied without a permit under Reddy's authority and that the medicine originates from Australia. Then Singh calls her daughters to inquire. She stops Singham, then tells that Krishnaraj, the assistant commissioner, touched them inappropriately when he came to inquire. Krishnaraj also told Singham earlier that he had no knowledge of calling Ramakrishna. All officers believe that. But Singham thought it was a fake report. Then he decides to hack Tele Network Server. So, Singham hires a hacker named Murli to hack into the cell company's network server and they can form that assisted commissioner Krishnaraj called Commissioner Ramakrishna. Also find that a call took place for a few seconds during the commissioner's murder to a man named Malaya. Singham meets Selvam in a bar. One of Reddy's men who authorized the attack at the train station. Suspecting him of murdering the commissioner. Singham team searches his house and finds a firearm and Australian money. Meanwhile Whittle receives information from his manager, then calls Reddy. Who calls Singham and assures him that Selvam is permitted to have them. Singham team left his house. On next day, Viram and Srinivas show Singham Andhra Today book, an article written about, Singham being a corrupt police officer and he exported Reddy for personal gain and questioned about room number 406. Putting Singham's reputation at edge. Written by an author Agni. Who's revealed to be Vidya. Vidya is actually a journalist, tasked to write a thrilling article in Vizik and she chooses to portray Singham. Singham's family and Home Minister Ramnathan are confused by the article and Reddy suggests to Singham to keep his head down. Reddy nod to arrest his men. Andhra Pradesh Home Minister and Tamil Nadu Home Minister called Singham and inquiries about a status report on the Karing case. Singham explains his way of approach in this case. Shubha Rao called Singham and told Malaya is a assistant commissioner Krishnaraj's car driver. After commissioner murder he took long medical leave. Singham team went to Malaya's native for investigation. Malaya revealed that, Reddy killed Commissioner. Assisted Commissioner Krishnaraj were in the spot. Singham now understand all the reports are fake and mobile location of criminal. The next day, Singham sends the entire force of Vizik to arrest every suspected criminal in the city including Reddy's men. You are watching Cinema Stories. Please subscribe our channel and hit bell button for more video. Then he arrested Assistant Commissioner Krishnaraj. Reddy at first tolerates Singham's arrests but becomes suspicious when he arrests too many of his men. Reddy's man, Selvam is killed. Then Singham team went to Andhra Today Media Office, inquiring about Agni. Now Singham knows Vidya is actually a journalist, tasked to write a thrilling article. She was arrested for disturbing police officer duties and published a false news about a police officer. She paid penalty in court and come out. Later, Singham team found a man who was frequently visited to meet Commissioner. And tracked, he is a school teacher. He illuminates Singham that a harmful smoke assault from the close-by dump killed his 32 students, including his grandkids. 
He said that all political persons and pollution department and doctors reported students killed by food poison. Singham team went to garbage dump and found all medical waste and electrical waste all from Australia. Singham understands that Ramakrishna intended to expose illegal dumping of electronic waste and medical waste which included tablets being sold to the public and the smoke attack on the school. So, Reddy killed police commissioner. The garbage is being imported by Vizek Scraps owner Rajiv Krishna in exchange for free metal scrap delivery to steel factories in Australia. Reddy sent Ravi to kill school teacher. Meanwhile Singham went harbour to open Whittle Steel's shipped containers. Reddy sent his men to kill Singham. Who opened containers? That all are medical waste and electrical waste. He took snaps. Reddy's men tried to kill Singham. He fights with them, while Ravi chasing school teacher to kill. Teacher called Singham and tells. Ravi killed teacher. Singham arrives too late. Whittle calls Singham anonymously with Reddy and Rajiv on the line and threatens to kill Singham's family if he continues with the case. Singham planned he must get to the bottom of who Reddy's boss is. He starts with chasing down and arresting Ravi. He enters into Reddy's house and arrests him and put into jail. Singham discloses the secrets of the case with Home Minister. Then decides to visit Australia to see who was speaking with him anonymously in phone. Singham comes Australia with his wife Kavya. Pushparaj, who is Kavya company's dealer, receives them. Singham sent drone camera to see about Whittle company. Singham visit Whittle's office and get Wi-Fi password. While hacker Murli copies Whittle's confidential files. Whittle send his men to kill Singham. Whittle frames Singham as drug smuggler try to escape from Australia. So, in airport Singham stopped by Australian police. Singham explains that he is a Indian police officer and arrested drug smuggler Danny who killed Australian police in international sea border. Then, Australian police respect him and send. When, Singham returns, Shubha Rao tells that, Reddy has been bailed by three criminals who framed the commissioner for supposed assault on one of their spouses. And justify the murder as vengeance. Singham is likewise terminated from the CBI for speaking out of turn. But, Singham requests Home Minister transfer him as a Andhra Pradesh cop in Vizek to continue pursuing Reddy's case. Then Singham killed two of three criminals, those help Reddy to come out. And framed they became a prover against Reddy. So, Reddy goon killed them. When Singham stopped Whittle's shipped containers in harbour, Whittle rushed to India, forced Singham to meet him in his office. Whittle tells Dhurai Singham to stay out of his way, and close Reddy's case file, and release all containers. Singham team start with chasing down and gun firing against Reddy and his men, killed one by one. Finally Shubhu Rao killed Reddy, whom previously killed his 9-year-old son in a city riot to defend Ram Prasad's position. Then later, the honest customs officer transferred, and containers are released. When Singham knows, stops containers in roadway and reveals Whittle's containers to the press. Singham calls Whittle to his police station and gives him another chance to repent for whom he's hurt. Singham and Kavya later visit Tutukudi to attend Kavya's grandma's funeral. They are followed by Rajiv who sends Singham and Kavya photo to Whittle. Singham notices Rajiv and arrested him. When Vidya attempts to interview Whittle who understands she came for help him. She is captured and beaten, then drugged. Whittle demands Singham to release Rajiv and Singham should be in Tutukudi otherwise he will kill Vidya. With help from Murli, Singham arranged duplicate SIM card to locate in Tutukudi and went to Vizek. Singham finds a vehicle belonging to Whittle's men and traces it to a hospital. Rescues Vidya from an hospital and admitted in Kavya's factory hospital. Whittle calls professional killer from Mumbai to kill Singham. Killer bombs Vizek police station and attempt to kill Singham in roadway, injuring Srinivas who is sent to the hospital. Singham decides to finish this once and for all and gets an arrest warrant against Whittle. Using computer evidence of agreements signed with medical companies, hacked by Murli. And video statement of Rajiv in front of Tutukudi magistrate and commissioner. The very next day, Murli track his mobile number and find all the way to Hyderabad. Whittle being hides in container truck and escaped to Telangana and got flight, even Singham stops flight and has him arrested. Whittle escapes custody into a nearby forest, where Singham catches him and after a long fight, Singham kills Whittle, who dies there. Singham regains his post and respect while Ram Prasad is fired out from cabinet position for assisting his son. Kavya is revealed to be six months pregnant and Vidya severs contact with Singham after getting engaged to a good prospect. 
Singham receives a call from Home Minister Ramanathan who calls him for another mission. Thank you very much for watching this video. Like and subscribe our channel.